Hello friends, uh, this is Sarveshwa Inani. Today we will discuss how to use expand function in eViews. Okay, first we should know why to use expand function. So for that purpose I need to show you some data. Suppose this is my data. Here I have date series and my futures return series and my spread. Spread is the difference between futures and spot prices. This is data for the Nifty uh, Indian index. So here uh, I just want to show suppose in this kind of data the time series data we have some time series like that contains uh, day, month, year or implicitly they also have quarters and suppose we are running a regression of a variable on other variable here suppose I want to just regress futures return in this column on the spread column key is a futures return a function of a spread. In that situation, sometimes I want to measure the impact of, uh, I can say, uh, time dummies. Like, is there any day of week effect by using a weekday? In that situation, I have to generate six dummy variables. Oh, or if I want to see the impact of month, so 11, like n minus one uh, dummy variables I have to create. So this is very time taking task. Suppose in data, we have 30 years data then we have to generate 29 dummies. So this is not easy. It is a very time taking task. In my earlier video, I had discussed how to use expand command to generate these kind of variables and just make a group to use regression. But in this video, uh, I would just define how to use these uh, uh, dummy time dummies, especially time dummies in our regression efficiently. I am using these dummies here directly in regression. So it can save our time. A lot of time so okay just start uh, suppose I want to just estimate equation uh, where I say give my futures written are uh, function of a constant and uh, I say spread and I just want to see the impact of a dummy variable time dummy that is my weekday I just want to check for uh, day of week effect so what I am doing here simply I am just putting at expand and just mentioning here um, based on expand my data based on uh, weekday and here this weekday will generate seven day I just want to drop my first because I have included intercept already here so I am just at drop first in this way now my regression is ready enter here I can see all the data I want here day 2 day 3 uh, day 4 day 5 day 6 day 7 and the day 1 is there here in coefficient and all these coefficients are showing their increments but none of them are significant in the same way what I can do here I can just put here in instead of weekday I can generate 11 dummies for months simply for month at month okay this is for 11 months from 2 to from 2nd month to 12th month. In the same way I can generate by using my quarter command. Suppose I want to measure for all my quarters. So quarters uh, Q U A R T R quarter. Okay. This is for quarter. In the same way in my database I have data for 15 years. I can generate this kind of dummies, time dummies using expand command for a year also. So this is the way, this is very easy and very fast time saving task in which we can use expand command and just save a lot of time. Thanks for watching friends.